Okay, so today we'll be learning how to plot common base characteristics using LTSpice. So let's start with picking up the elements required. So I'll pick up an NPN transistor and two batteries to forward bias the input junction and reverse bias the output junction. We'll rearrange the elements to rotate the NPN transistor, I can use control R and to take a mirror image, I can use control E. We'll also rearrange the elements and call the batteries VE e and VCC. Also, we'll be giving voltage 5 volts to VEE e and We'll be also giving voltage to VCC, which will be equal to 10 volts. Now, let's connect the circuit using the wire tool. Using the hand tool, we can rearrange all the elements in the circuit. Once the circuit is complete, now we'll use a simulation tool to simulate. But we'll, uh, we just noted that uh, we have to forward bias the input junction and hence I've rotated my battery. We'll be selecting DC sweep and since we are seeing the input, volta input characteristics first, I'll vary VEE from 0 to 5 in steps of 0.5. Once I simulate it, now I look for the milliameter probe, the probe that is used to plot current. Now you can see uh, the current that, is get, that has pl been plotted is the current that is flown due to the battery. Since the battery current and the current uh, direction of the transistors are in opposite direction, I will be plotting minus IE. So this gives me input characteristics of the diode, I can also, of the transistor, I can also change the transistor by clicking on it and selecting another transistor. Let me take, take, uh, take BC547B which is very commonly used, right, so I'll see, I can observe that my characteristics changes. Now let's plot the output characteristics. So I'll change my battery that is varying from VEE to VCC and I can then plot my characteristics. Now the current that I'll be plotting is going to be IC. So, we've plotted both input and output characteristics easily using LT Spice. 